You've worked with Shakira, the uh, one half oh, of the, Shakira, of the yeah. amazing Super Bowl halftime show, Shakira. Yes. You worked with Shakira. I worked with Shakira on Wizards of Waverly Place. And the premise was that... Uh, Why did yeah. people go, ooh? <laughs> I was Uncle Kelbo yeah. Yeah. on the show Wizards of Waverly Place. I was on like a half dozen times. And one episode, it was shown that I was Shakira. In other words, my special powers, I would go live life with Shakira. She was actually in the episode. Oh, so you're actually what, you you become Shakira, you yes. are Shakira. We, we go back and forth. Yeah. But when we go back and forth, I also wore some Shakira-style outfits, which is a big bowl of wrong. Um, <laughs> but here's the thing. By the way, a doll, and you hang out, so I'm, I'm with her. Okay, so this one cat suit I had to wear with like holes on the side. Yeah. It was just wrong on so many levels. And I'm wearing a robe. Because you gotta match her look. She's wearing it, yes. and then you gotta wear the same thing. And by thing. the way, she in it? Yeah. Perfection. Yeah. Uh, me in it? Wow! Yeah. Um, <laughs> anyhow, so uh, Shakira says, let me, I'm wearing a robe. She goes, let me see. I go, no. Selena Gomez walks up and goes, what are you guys talking about? She goes, he won't let me see, you know, what he, and I go, okay. I, they kept on bothering me. So we went backstage. So I'm backstage with Shakira and Selena Gomez, and I did something I've never done before or since. I opened my robe like this, <laughs> and I'm wearing the cat suit. Yeah. And they love it. But anyone looking thinks there's a pervert. Yes. Oh, <laughs> well, by the way, anyone who's looking from the side is going, what's going on? Yeah, yeah. What is going on? Check this out, girls. Yes. But they were begging me. And then they both burst out laughing, which is appropriate. Right. But then, Shakira, when she hangs out, she dances like she dances. Yeah. Like, just hanging out, she'll do her things. And, Wait, and she, if, she's, if Shakira's at an ATM, she's, she's gyrating and... If she's, she's in the mood, right. if she's in the mood, <laughs> right. anywhere she does it. So, I was a huge fan of Shakira's, even though I never heard her music. Right. Um, <laughs> Completely true. And I told Selena, I go, I got a crush on her. I love her, you know? So she starts doing this stuff. Now, I'm wearing this little sheer thing, and I'm afraid I'm going to get a boner because <laughs> she's doing this bouncy thing, and I keep saying, you got to stop. Please stop your dance because once some music came on, she's just doing this all over, and I'm a foot away from Shakira doing that. Oh, my God. So I closed my robe and I... <laughs> We ran, ran away, away before you became uh, excited yeah. in any way. In, in one particular way. Yeah, well, yeah. we all know what's but going on. Way, We're all adults the way, in the room. Selena Gomez, who at the time was 18, it wasn't, she wasn't minor. But nonetheless, I have to have that. You know what? I mentioned earlier I wasn't sure that this episode would air. This will not air. This is not going to air, this episode. No, but the point When you're being... talking about, yeah, I'm getting an erection, but don't worry, she's 18. No, but the point is... She knows that I'm, like, into Shakira, so right. she's laughing her ass off. 18-year-olds right. know about boners, but I ran. <laughs> I ran to be appropriate. I think you did the right I, thing. I did the right thing. <laughs> I All think right. a man running with an erection is always appropriate. I didn't have an erection. <laughs> I was prepping. I do that. Anytime I get an erection, I just take off. By the way. I start running. By I the just way, do. I do. I run. I lost my virginity uh -oh. to, to a heckler when I was 20. In a, in a, you lost your virginity in, in a stand-up club to a heckler? Not in a club, but, but yeah, I mean, she had heckled me earlier in the evening. Later in the evening, it was on South Beach. She went, she apologized. She came up to me, and I'm like, I don't really want to talk to you. And then she kissed me, and I was like, wow, look at that. Um, and uh, she went running on the beach, ripping off her clothes, yelling, follow me. So I followed her. Uh, <laughs> to a lifeguard stand, and uh, yeah, that's how I lost my virginity. But you reminded me... Wait a minute, wait a minute, that's an amazing story. You, the, your first, the first person you're with heckled you. Yes. What does that I say? A, I'm a true comedian. This yes, day. yes. I am, the, I am a comedian. I knew I wanted to be one when I was eight years old. I didn't know I'd lose it to a heckler, but very fitting. Yeah. Um, Excellent and, crowd work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, <laughs> when we were having sex, there was no heckling. Yeah. That I will say. Yeah. That's, yeah. An, that's an incredible story. Yeah. But the point being is, when you said you run whenever you have a boner, so I, 
I, I kicked I had folded. I'm a Jewish boy. I folded my clothes. She's naked. I take up my clothes and I fold them. Folded them on the beach. I swear to God. Be right with you. <laughs> By the way, you're not far from it. Yeah, hold on. <laughs> I was Snap 20, I was still creases. living at home. So I kicked my stuff off the lifeguard stand during the festival, and I run downstairs naked, run naked with the festival, and I'm there, and there's a guy, like, about to steal my clothes, and I'm naked, and I go, you get away from <laughs> Which is so, so weird to be, yeah, you're about to thieve and a naked guy yeah. is with a boner yeah. is going, hey man, yeah. you know, and then yeah, I You thought, didn't have to point, yeah. <laughs> you know. But by the way, I did, did I? <laughs> Sorry. So by the way, I got my clothes together, I went back in the, up the stand to, to go back at it, and I folded my clothes again. Oh, you're a, you're, you're a tidy, you're a yeah, tidy well, fellow. I'm a little Jewish boy. Yeah. Now I'm a big Jewish man. <laughs> And I will fold my clothes as I see fit.